Shalom, brothers and sisters. The EU social media censorship laws are now officially enforceable. 2022, the EU Commission, using COVID as a convenient cover, heralded the passage of the Digital Services Act, the DSA. Since August 25 this year, the 19 largest digital platforms in Europe became subject to the Digital Services Act. The DSA was presented as a tool for the EU to rein in the power of social media corporations, but in reality, the primary purpose is to give the EU legal precedence to force big tech companies to apply EU censorship into the platforms, even if they are not European-based businesses. In other words, the goal is to force the entire Western world to accept European governance of online speech while ignoring national boundaries and constitutional protections similar to China's Great Firewall. The EU plans to use the DSA as a means to shut down domestic access to offending websites and content. Now, we've seen a similar process happening in Canada that's already been enacted. This is a preview of what it's going to be like under the BEAST system, where you will only receive what they approve and they will shut down access to anything that they deem offensive or wrong. And that will include any access to the truth, to the word of God, to Christians, and to any preaching about Jesus Christ, the only way to heaven. They will remove that completely and then give you the false narratives and the evil and the programming and the things they need you to believe to get you in line and processed and chop chop through the system of the beast. And this is this amazing world that they're building, that everyone is excited about. Agenda 2030, let's go. No, we go before you even get started properly with your Agenda 2030. Knock yourself out, it ends badly. I unsubscribe from the entire plan and I am out of here with Jesus Christ very, very shortly. And I feel really heartbroken for all of those whose eyes are still closed and don't want to see. None as blind as those who do not want to see. And none as deaf as those who do not want to hear. Pray that more people's hearts of stone become hearts of flesh. And they start believing and seeing the wonder that is Jesus Christ. God bless. Keep looking up. Shalom.